He is a theatrical legend, taking on one of theatre's legendary roles. At 82, Sir Ian McKellen is playing Hamlet. Oh, well, if the king liked up the tragedy, well, uh, the People of all shapes, sizes and colours and ages, and a lot of old actors have played it. I think I might just be the oldest. I might, I might have made that record, but I, I don't feel uh, it. Uh, and... Uh, the big bonus for me is actually quite a lot of stairs on our, our set here at Windsor, and I have to run up and down them quite a lot, and I'm, I've never been so fit. <laughs> Covid brought the curtain crashing down on the creative arts, and audiences are still small. Because of social distancing and only a half-full audience, it was rather like turning up for a Thursday matinee, you know. You think, hmm... <laughs> But come Monday, that changes and theatres can fully reopen. I'm a little bit nervous about that. I, I dare say the audience will be nervous too. Do audiences really want to come back and sit next to somebody with, with a cough who's a bit fidgety? I, I don't know whether our pattern of behaviour in so many areas of life, including going into public places, will, will have changed. Uh, will, will we swing back to normality? I suspect not for a little bit. It's 50 years since Sir Ian was last Hamlet. His distinguished career, versatile and varied. People who have influence over the, the, the purse strings uh, should realise that uh, it is an investment uh, supporting the arts. It's an investment in, in people's um, sense of liveliness and, and, and community and... Uh, not just um, stimulating the, the soul and the heart and the mind and the intellect, but bringing people together. Shakespeare's greatest tragedy, now a little moment of hope for theatres, audiences and actors. Laura Bundock, Sky News, Windsor.